Howdy guys, welcome back to Corpse Party. Alright, picking up where we left off. We still have five endings to show in Chapter 5. And I'm pretty sure I know how to get three of them. But I'll make this fast. I want to try to show every single ending that's left in this video. Um, I won't show any more red herrings. I'll just try to get straight to the point on how to get these other five endings. But the first thing I want to try, I think I know how to get the true ending. So I'm going to breeze through this, but the first thing you want to do for this one is don't let Mayu get caught by Kizumi, this guy right here. So let me cut back on the next little branch, and then I'll talk more about it. Okay, so we didn't get captured with Yuka. The next thing I want to do is not get captured to make sure that Ayumi and Yoshiki are both still alive. So I'll do that and then cut back at the next little split in the storyline. Okay, well, here's the next thing I want to try. I want to try following Naomi without branching off, because last time I went to the restrooms or something. Wait, please, don't run away by yourself. And I... I think this is going to change something. If it doesn't, I got a bunch of other ideas. Yuka, come on, stay right by my side. So, I mean, it's worth a shot. There's a couple other things I want to try at the end of the game anyways. So, again, we didn't let Yuka get caught, obviously, because she's with us. And Yoshiki and Mayu are fine. Neither of them are dead right now. So instead of going left right there, let's just go right. Stops here. Trail of blood from Shinohara's body, it stops here. But why? Okay, I think just go right? What's the sensation? I feel that we're not supposed to go this way. Well, let me still keep going, because I'm still not going to go left back at the previous fork. And there was like that weird little cutscene with um, with um, Satoshi and his sister. Um, oh, okay. So yeah, we've already seen this part. Nothing's going to change here. So let's keep going. I already checked all these. I got all these name tags. But um, yeah, again, you see that Ayumi and Yoshiki are fine. So maybe I can try go. So we have everybody except Naomi. Let me try going back now, actually. Can I go this way now? This is different. Naomi, where are you? Sure is dark in here. What's wrong? Over there, there's a person. Wait, have I seen this before? It's been a while since I played. She's right, there is somebody standing there just ahead. Is that Naomi? Naomi! Naomi, is that you? It is Naomi! Man, you really had us worried. She looks weird though. I mean, you can kinda see her. Yeah, she looks weird. Oh, she's carrying Seiko. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, damn, Naomi's pissed. Or, or just screaming. I don't think I've seen that before. Wait, what the? What the that didn't even make sense. That didn't even make sense. But I think that was a new ending. Let me take a look. I'm glad I just saved too. One, two, three, four. Yeah, six. So we, that was definitely an ending. So let me get back to the save I was just on. There's got to be a way to save everybody. There's got to be a way. Okay, so let's keep going then. I still didn't do the... Oh, I got to go through this again. I still didn't do the bathroom scene, so let me try going through everything while still skipping that bathroom scene. I think I showed it two videos ago, but there's like a weird cutscene between Mayu and Satoshi. And I don't know if that leads to... I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to play it out, but um, let's keep going. I'm going to cut right here.
Um, let's try not chanting, actually. That's the first thing I'll try. Everything's gone dark. Did we miss our chance? No! My friends. Yuki. I don't think I've seen this, have I? Welcome to Heavenly Host Elementary. I don't think I've seen that one. But let me take a look and see if I got a star for it. I hope I did, because I'm still missing quite a few. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're missing three now. That's that's uh that's good news. So I think I know how to get two more. Let me cut back to uh if I do the chant correctly. I'm gonna cut back right here. And then um I think it's like chant six times, and then and then we can wait the timer out. So I'll cut back in just a second. Okay, here we go. So the tongue, yes. Notebook, no. Black cat plushie, yes. And the tape, no. So it's working. Okay, there's Naomi, good. And then how many is there? One, two, three, four, five. So we gotta say it's six times. Um, one also for Sashiko. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. All right, here we go. Wait, was there a timer? I could have swore there was a timer. Maybe I got to keep running for the timer to turn on. Or maybe I can walk around and do some other stuff. I'm still missing four name tags. I guess I'll just take my time <laughs> and start looking. A bell toll. Oh, it's the bell tolling. I forget. Okay, so that's one. Let's just wait for the bell to toll 12 times. But in the meantime, I'm just going to kind of search for name tags. I know there was one when I took the puzzle the wrong way. So maybe if I do the puzzle correct, you know, the one where you have to follow the spirit. Maybe I can do something with that to get some more name tags. Can I come in here? No, it's just it's like a wall. I can't walk any further. But this might take a while. The bell is actually pretty slow. <laughs> I was like panicking when I first went through this, but it gives you plenty of time. Should I start coming this way now? Oh, I still didn't do this little cutscene. Let me try walking over here now that the bell's tolling. I know I'm kind of wasting time, but <laughs> I don't know. I think some of these might be tricky. Um, like I'd be, I'd feel better if I was missing like one or two name tags, but I'm still missing four. Oh, no way! There was a name tag right there in the rubble. That's good. I think I'm missing what? Oh, I can't even open the menu right now. I think I'm missing three now. So let me check back at the puzzles. And then maybe try like falling down or going the right way. Because I think that spawned one of the name tags just out of the blue if I fell down. So let's try this. I think you went down here, up here. Oh, I went the wrong way. <laughs> but when I fell last time, there was a name tag down here. This one right here. But it didn't, it, I mean, I've already gotten it, so it doesn't matter. Let me try falling down on the other one, because I didn't fall on the other one. Or did I? 
I don't know. The school day is over now. Any students still in the building? May never go home again. Oh, that was actually faster than I thought it would go to 12. That was faster than I thought it was. Everything's gone dark. Did we miss our chance? No. My friends. Oh, is this the same ending? I think it's the same ending. Well, that kind of sucks. You would think that'd be a different ending. Let me double check. Let me check how many stars I have. But that was the exact same as the last one I showed. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it's still the same amount. Okay, well, one more thing I could try. Let's not give her her tongue or the cat plushie and just give her the two bad items. That could do something. If it doesn't, I'm just not going to show it. Okay, well, that one didn't work. Um, so the next thing I want to try, which is not going to lead to a good ending, but I think this one will definitely lead to a new ending. Let me um let me load this file right here. This is the scene where you can get captured by the the mannequin. Uh, let me grab this really quick. But there is a opportunity to leave with Yoshiki, and then let Ayumi die. I think, which before I've shown it where Ayumi survives and Yoshiki dies. So to do that, I don't know if you have to talk to this guy first, but um, just grab this notebook right here. It's the fourth one. And then when you go to leave, that's when this little cutscene happens. And then I think get caught right here. I think. And then just leave. <laughs> so, I mean, now uh, Aomi's out of the picture. That's got to change something. That's got to be another ending. So let me keep proceeding on this path. And then, oh, I can't even switch back to Yoshiki right now. Gosh, I don't even remember what to do right now. So let me keep playing. If I come across anything different, I'll cut back. Okay, let's see what this says. Yoshiki, what's wrong? Where's Shinozaki? So it was some kind of monster? But how? That That shouldn't... It's my fault. Yoshiki, I left her to die. I'm going to have to live with that for the rest of my life. It's the monster's fault she died, not yours. You did nothing wrong, Kishinuma. Come on. Let's make sure nobody else dies. Let's find Miss Yui and get the hell out of here. Oh man, I completely forgot about Miss Yui. There's got to be an ending where I save Miss Yui. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I swore to her that I would live through this for both of us. I just don't get it though. She's such a scaredy cat and yet she told me to run. She said don't worry about me, just run. I mean, she had to have been scared shitless. Scared out of her mind. And yet, she just accepted it. If she were still alive, she'd die again in a second if it meant keeping you guys safe. That's all she ever worried about. So I guess that duty falls on me now. And I swear I won't let her down. I'll stake my life on it. It wasn't just uh, it wasn't just us she was looking after, Kishinuma. It was everyone from class, you included. That's right, not a single other person is going to die if I have anything to say about it. So let's find Miss Yui and put this place behind us for good. Make sure you keep it together, okay? If you leave yourselves too vulnerable, this place will swallow you up. The darkening will take you over and you'll become part of this building like a stain. That's what that... Kabiki guy wrote anyway. Understood. Okay, well, let's keep going. I mean, the dialogue was a little bit different, but up until now, nothing's really changed. All right, well, here we are. Let me think. Yeah, last time, like, Yoshiki left the room for like a second. Wait, who's that? 
Oh, now Miss Huey's dead there. That's definitely different. Miss Huey, God, she's unconscious. Oh, she's just unconscious. Miss Huey, pull yourself together. Come on, wake up. Don't tell me. No, she's... Oh, she is dead. She's ice cold. You've got to be kidding me. Miss Huey, please, no. You've gotten yourself in pretty deep, huh, Miss Huey? Looks like you're Shinozaki's partner in crime once more. One last time. But you... You can't hear a word I'm saying anymore, can you? Damn. Well, what do I do now? Oh no, I can't even teleport back. Alright, wait, what do I do now? Gosh, it's getting so confusing, like, juggling all these different scenarios. Um, what do I have? I've already got the notebook. Um, I think, let me just walk around. I think there's another cutscene if I just, like... Oh, wait, do I have the... No, I don't even have the, the statue. I don't know. Let me, let me cut back. I gotta walk around and figure out what to do now. Okay, well, we never completed the, the notebook, because we never went to grab the last page. I don't know. It's different. Um, I mean, I'm going to go to the principal's office right now. I just got the key. So let's see how this one plays out. It's got to be different. What is this place? What happened to me? I was in the incinerator and... Okay, so we're back in this room. Um, where am I? Okay, well, nothing's different. We just don't have Aomi. So let's meet up with these guys. Yoshiki! Satoshi and Yuka, too. Good to see you guys. Uh-huh. Naomi, Naomi went after this monster that took Shinohara's body, and we got separated from him. Got separated from her. Huey too, God. All right. Now there's nothing keeping us in this godforsaken school anymore. Let's just find Nakashima and get the hell out of here. Yeah, sounds like a plan to me. Naomi, are you okay? Oh, so Naomi's here right now. Really had us worried. Good to see her uninjured at least. Did you find Shinohara? Seiko? No. I don't. I think we can bring Shinohara back with us. I wish we could. If we don't hurry, we're going to get attacked and we'll all wind up as part of the school. I hate to do it, but we really need to get out of the get out of here while we have a chance. Okay. All right, well, there's the four of us. So she could we beg of you. Oh, we're doing it right here. So we don't even go to the other room. Interest. This has to be a different ending. This is definitely a new ending. Wait, before you all go... Hmm? Don't stay home tomorrow, please. Uh, come to school, please. Wait a second. This might be the same ending as one of the other ones. That sounds very familiar. I might have come across this ending while doing something else. Like, there's two ways to get the same ending. I've definitely never tried that before. I turned to my room and collapsed in my bed. Heard a faint voice. Satoshi, Satoshi. It's coming from outside the window. I got up to look, and there in the distance, I saw a person dressed in white waving at me. Oh, maybe this is different. Is that... It was Yoshiki, but he wasn't quite himself. His eyes were... Opened unusually wide and he was staring at my window with soulless black pupils. On top of that, he was flashing me a bizarre toothy grin with a decidedly unnatural curve to it. And I could see the saliva pouring out from between each of his teeth. Even the wave of his hand was off. It was vigorous and forceful, as if he were overacting a part. Satoshi, Satoshi, come on out, come on out the hell is he doing? At this point, I didn't care. I darted out of the house to meet him, still wearing my school uniform. 
Yo, Shiki, what are you doing? If you if you weren't there, then Shinozaki Shinozaki would. Wait, how is it his fault? He came rushing towards me at full speed, holding something in his hand that glinted in the light. Oh damn! I didn't even save. Does this matter? That come on. Now I have to play through and check both options. Gosh. That was like 20 minutes of getting through that storyline. I wish I had more. They only give you three places to save. It's ridiculous. All right, we're going to dodge left. He stopped himself mid-charge, throwing the knife he held in his hand to the ground with a dull metallic clank. If you weren't... Yoshiki, what's going on? Don't worry. I wasn't going to stab you. I was actually planning to stab myself. What the hell are you saying? Didn't you swear to Shinazaki that you lived through this? I don't deserve to. I don't deserve anything. I'm a worthless piece of shit for abandoning her. For running when I should have stayed and fought. Well, how's dying going to help anything? You killing yourself sure as hell isn't going to bring Shinozaki back. Plus, do you really think that's what she would have wanted? That's what she'd want? Huh? Urgh. Shinozaki. Shinozaki. I stood there in the rain for... I don't even know how long. Just staring at Yosh uh, Yoshiki as he knelt there crying. Soon, I began crying right alongside him. Wrong end. Well, I mean, at least he didn't kill Satoshi. Damn. That's definitely a new ending. But now I got to go back and check if uh, dodging right is going to change anything. Gosh dang it. All right. I'll cut back when I get there. All right. Here we go. So last time we did left. I think. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. I'm pretty sure I did left. So we're going to go right this time. <clears throat> we're going to see if that changes anything. If you weren't Yoshiki, what's going on? That changed nothing. Why would it even give you the option? <sighs> I had to try it, though, because I don't know what else to do. Oh, you know what? There's one more thing I want to try. So uh, what I'm going to do is still save everybody, um, make sure Yoshiki and Aomi are alive, and then make sure um, make sure Shato Satoshi's little sister's alive too. But instead of instead of doing the bathroom cutscene, we're not going to do that one, and still get out of here alive, like beat the timer. And the bathroom cutscene I'm talking about. That's the one where Sato, she's alone with uh, Yuka. And um, he asks Yuka, like, do you have a crush on anybody? So we're going to skip that cutscene and see if that changes anything. All right, let's get out of here. I'll try to go the correct way this time. Can I go in here? Oh, I already checked in there. I'll try to go the correct way and see if there's maybe a name tag on the way, because I'm still missing three. But I don't think that's it. I think I still got to do some searching. Yeah, 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 the bell, I know. But gosh, I I feel like I'm getting close now. We're definitely going to 100% complete this. All right, let's see if I can remember it this time. So I think like that. And then, God, this is like 100 times harder doing it backwards. Um, doesn't look like there's a name tag. That's fine. And then, I don't think I fell on the next one. Can I come over here? Oh, this is actually the right way to go. I don't know. I'm at a lot. You know what? If I can't find the name tags, I might just look it up, because I've been playing this game for so long now. It's like, I just want to wrap it up. But I'll still look for myself a little bit longer. Gosh dang it, man. The freaking dead ends. Um, I think I go this way. And I think I only have until the sixth bell. So it is actually a little bit tighter than I thought it was. Alright, let's see. No, that was the wrong way. Is there a name tag down here, though? 
No. Okay. And then I think I just go straight down here. Oh wait, I still gotta get out of here. Oh damn. Um. Oh no, that's the fifth bell too. Gosh, I gotta hurry now. Um, I might not even make it. It's gonna be close. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Oh my gosh, that, that felt like tighter than last time. But anyways, let's see if this changes anything. Cause there's like a, I don't know, it's, there's, during this cutscene, Yuka was like, oh, I lied when I told you there was somebody I like at school. It's actually you I like. She said that to Satoshi, but they never had that conversation now. Let's go. All right. Okay. Please work. Please work. Please work. Hold tightly to your Sashiko scrap. Don't let go. This is definitely different. So that cutscene where uh, Yuka got stabbed by the principal wasn't there. Is this the true ending? Whoa, are we... We are. We're home. Big brother! Yuka, we really made it. Yuki, thank you so much. And so, the five of us who survived were able to return to Kisaragi Academy, to the real world, in our own time. For a while, we were all just so happy to be home and to be alive. We were overjoyed. But it didn't take long before the grim reality of what happened wiped the smiles off our faces. Miss Yui, Shinohara, Morishige, and Suzumoto. They weren't with us anymore. Well, be careful on your way home, okay? I will. Goodbye. Later. Wait, before you all go... Hmm? Don't stay home tomorrow. Come to school, please. Okay. I didn't think I'd be able to sleep that night after all the things I'd seen. But I wound up sleeping like a rock. The next morning, it was with a heavy... Uh, it was with heavy hearts that we all trudged toward a school devoid of Miss Yui and the others, yet fate still had one more sick twist in store for us. Shinohara? Morishige? Am I supposed to know who you're talking about? Oh no! Our homeroom TA's name is Matsudo? You're still half asleep or something? A transfer? Are we getting someone new in, in here? It's like they never existed now. Oh my gosh. It was like the four people who died in that school had never existed to begin with. No, this isn't right. How can no one remember any of them? All those times we spent with Seiko and the others? Am I supposed to accept that none of them, uh, none of that really happened? Miss Yui, Suzumoto, Morishige, and Shinohara. Are you telling me the only they only exist in our memories now? That's just beyond cruel. Wow, that is kind of sad, actually. Still absorbing innumerable souls and ingesting the thoughts of innocent boys and girls. Heavenly Host Elementary stands firm with a newly appointed Sashiko at its core. There are those precious few who survived those who lost their lives and those who are overcome by the dark curse of their uh, the dark curses therein and among them all are the spirits of those who were wronged bearing an unimaginable pain 
and endlessly searching for respite for their sadness. For a place to call home. Chapter 5, End. Damn! That's, that's gotta be like the real ending. But, I mean... Oh, that's a Satoshi and, um... Naomi. Sorry to call you in here like this, Satoshi. Oh, it's not a problem after all. Oh, it's not a problem at all. What's up? There's something I want you to see. Here. Huh? Isn't that... It is. It's that unsent text message from Shinoharo I showed you. Yeah. I need to tell you something. So it was you? Wait, what was her? Did she write that to herself? Seiko couldn't move, but instead of saving her, I put a... What? I put a noose around her neck? What is going on now? You don't remember any of it? When I saw that scene play out, my mind just shut down. I couldn't think at all, and a black mist began forming around me. I was slipping away. I didn't care either. Nothing mattered to me anymore. I would have welcomed death. Oh, she, okay. That's what she was watching in there. She saw herself put the noose around Seiko's neck. Oh. I wish I could take it back. The darkness had begun seeping into every pore. My body was pitch black. I was right on the verge of losing consciousness, and then... No hard feelings. This is that text message. Why am I receiving it now? Doesn't matter. I don't even want to live anymore. Living is too painful. I'm sure Seiko must have died hating me. There's just nothing left to live for. It's the same message. Are you trying to tell me something? She must be spamming me. She's probably furious. No, there's no way she's mad at me. We had such a huge fight. She can't possibly forgive me. Especially, after, uh, especially not after what I did to her. Seiko, there's no excuse for my actions. You... You must hate me, right? You have to hold some kind of grudge, right? Oh my gosh. I love you, Seiko. I love you. Oh my gosh. She really existed, didn't she? She really did spend all that time with us, right? 
She did. She was real, Naomi. Miss Yui and the others too. I can't stand the thought that I'll never see them. Just one last time. I just want to talk to Seiko one last time. I know you do. Well, there's the true ending, which is actually kind of more sad than like all the other endings with them dying. God. Oh, there's a little bit more. Let's see what's going on here. I mean, honestly, I... Uh, Corpse Party Book of Shadows? Is that on the uh, Steam? I, uh, I definitely want to play that game. Probably not next, but I'll probably get around to playing it on this channel. Man, that was like... I'm glad, uh... I'm glad, like, most of the characters survived. I mean, I'm kind of sad Miss Yui didn't make it because she was a good teacher. Uh, she was looking out for her students. But, I mean, Satoshi survived. Yuka survived, which, I mean, Yuka died in a couple bad endings. <laughs> And, you know, like, it, it's, it is what it is. It, it's, it's definitely a horror game, so. At least it's somewhat a happy ending. But again, I like playing these games because you never know what kind of ending to expect. You don't know, I mean, you don't, it can go either way. It really can. Good endings, bad endings, and sometimes even the good endings aren't really all that great. But... Um, we still have another ending to take care of. And uh, three name tags, I believe, which I have no idea. Absolutely no. I, th I like. I feel like I've tried everything there is to try. So I'm going to play through Chapter 5 one more time and like rack my brain trying to look for anything. But I feel like I've checked every option. It's got to be something stupid. And then for the name tags, I'll probably end up looking those up. Um, if I find them on my own, great. But since I'm missing three, chances are I'm going to have to look at least a couple of them up. So I'm going to cut right here and keep playing. And if I come across anything or have to look it up, then I will cut back. Okay, well, I think we're coming to the last ending, which I did have to look up. I couldn't figure out on my own. Um, for this ending, if I did everything right, so everybody's still safe. Yoshiki, Ayumi, Satoshi, everybody's alive. But for the fifth page of Naho's notebook, I didn't grab that, which I was under the impression I had to grab that to progress the storyline. I didn't know that was even an option, so I probably would have, that would have taken me forever to figure out. Like, literally, that would have taken me forever, because I thought I had to grab it. So, all we have is four out of the five pages. I hate to do it, but we really need to get out of this uh, while we have a chance. So, let's see what changes here. All right, let's, uh, let's go. Let me see. This looks very similar to one of the other endings. Was I asleep? This is my room. But I don't remember escaping from that school where everybody died. I was definitely there though. I wish I could forget Shinohara's lifeless face and Morishige's panicked voice. There's no way it was a dream. Good morning, big brother. Er, Yuka. Good morning. What's up? You seem awfully peppy. Did you make it back with me? Breakfast! Breakfast, silly. If you don't come down, none of us can start eating. Ah, okay. Actually, I think I'll skip breakfast this morning. Aw, why? I'm not especially hungry. I'm sure you can understand. 
That's no excuse. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day, you know. Look, just leave me alone, okay? You were there too. You saw what happened yesterday. Hmm? Big brother, are you crying? Did you have a scary dream? You could, didn't you? Mokida! Shinohara! You look pretty down, you okay? I, uh, yeah. I bet I know what it is. Your heart's just all a flutter because you got paired together for... Because we got paired together for... Tending shop? What's tending shop? Am I right? Huh? What are you talking about? Mm-hmm, pervert. What? Lusty boy. Am I dreaming now? Or was everything else just a dream? Morning, everybody. Brought some bowls for the soup. Think this will be enough? Morning. Ah, uh, good morning. Yeah, that looks like plenty. Oh, top of the morning, you sexy beast. I guess it really was just a nightmare. Ah, Seiko, how many times have I told you stop grabbing my ass? Maybe this is the good ending and it was all a dream. No, something's about to happen. I see you all serious and focused, blah, blah, blah. Stop. Cut it out, jeez. Oh, now that's no good. Our table has to be kept clean. Wait. This is like deja vu. In fact, this is exactly how it was. It's the same as my dream, the dream where we all got sent to Heavenly Host. Was it real after all? Is the whole day just restarting? I have to put a stop to it. Uh, what are you what are you going on about now? Heavenly Host Elementary? Oh, I'm surprised you've got you've heard of that, Mokita. I was actually planning on telling you guys a ghost story about that place later tonight. Satoshi Don't tell me you've been slacking in your duties and daydreaming about some haunted school now. Oh, it's Naomi. Aw. Aw, busted. Uh, not like he's the only one who's been slacking, though, Shig. Oh yeah, more Shige! <laughs> I haven't been slacking, I simply needed to make copies of the script for drum. Damn! This- I- guys, this is literally, like, the hardest ending to find. Like, who would go through everything perfectly, save everybody, and then knock at the last piece of paper for the notebook? That just seems so, like... I don't know, it just seems like kind of hard to find, in my opinion. I don't know, Morishige, that sounds like an excuse to me. Come on then, come on. It's your turn, right, Mokita? Your post awaits. Oh, it's Mishishido. Now hold on really tightly, dig your nails into it as if you have to. Just don't let go, we're gonna... Pull on until it rips it apart in the ape. If I was Satoshi, I would grab the doll and run out of the room. <laughs> it's like, come on. Come on, Satoshi. <laughs> grab it and run. Everybody stop. What are you doing? Like, it, if he was like, like if, if I was in Satoshi's, there's a million ways to stop this. He's already seen everything that's going to happen. There's a million ways. No, absolutely not. I just... This charm is dangerous. Why won't you understand? I gotta say, it is pretty unusual you, for you to get so worked up. Well, we're almost finished, so just sit tight, okay? It'll all be over soon. They're gonna be whisked away to Heavenly Host. If I don't... If I don't go too, Naomi, all of them will be in terrible danger. Just grab the doll. Like, <laughs> like make a huge scene if you have to, but... Grab it. I don't know. This is stop. Like, he could stop this. All right. Let's welcome one more into the circle. What can I do? What can I do to uh, protect them this time around?
Well, it didn't say... It didn't say wrong end. But, I mean, it was just another ending. So, I think that's all the endings for Chapter 5. Um, I, I played through again. I, uh... I couldn't figure any... Uh, that's why I had to look up this ending. But I did not find the other three name tags, so... I don't think I want to look anymore. I think I'm just going to look those up too. So let me take a look and see where those are at, and then I'll cut back and show the three I'm missing. Here we go. Okay. There's a student ID name tag mixed with all these various... I could have swore I checked everything in here. I could have sworn, but... That's one less. That's perfect. So two more missing, and I think um, they're just going to be in the next couple of rooms, so let me cut that right now. Oh, what? There it is! There was one of them right there. Can I only get that during the chase scene? Because I could have swore I checked all these. I'm in the... Or not the chase scene, but the the very end. I think there's one more in the skulls right here. But I don't know if I can only get it during the the part where it's like counting down. Damn it, I thought that was it. But it was just a stupid... Oh, where is it? Oh, where are you? Wait, one, two... It's got to be in here somewhere. That was it. Damn it. Alright, well... One more to go, and I, I think it's in those skulls. I could have swore I checked every single one. But let me go back and check one more time while it's not counting down. I'm just missing one name tag now. I'll cut back. Numerous several skulls have been placed in even a row on the table. Okay. This name tag right here, you cannot get unless you're in this cutscene where the, the bell's going. Like, how would you know to check that while you're trying to get out of here as fast as possible? Like, you're not going to stop and talk to all these heads again while you're trying to get out of here as fast as possible. It's not fair. I uh, I, I can't believe it would be hidden right there, but it it does definitely have to be during this this cutscene. Um, I checked a couple times while it wasn't during this cutscene. So, uh, gosh, man. Oh my gosh. I, uh... It's just that that's ridiculous. That's way too hidden. Did anybody else find that on their own without looking it up? I would have never, ever been able to find that in a million years. There's no way. It, it's like, first off, like, I don't even know if I checked all the heads on my normal playthrough because there were so many of them. But who would take the time to check all those heads while you're trying to escape this place? It, it's just, that's crazy. That's insane. So we got 40 out of 40. Um, and we have all the endings too. For chapter... Um, chapter 5. So all that's left now is... Um, the extras, which I'm definitely not going to do in this video. And it looks like these are going to be pretty easy. So we got one, two, three, four left. Because they're all just one star, so I think there's one ending for all. I don't even know what these are. I don't know if they're just really quick, but I haven't even checked them out yet. So if they're short, I'm going to put them all in the next video. But if they're a little bit longer, I might put two together. Or, I mean, if they're really long, I'll make a video for each one. All right, well, that is it for this video. <laughs> we completed Chapter 5. I've been recording for three and a half hours, but that's that's not even... I have another video I have to kind of splice together, but most of that's just me looking around trying to figure out what to do. So throughout the whole game, I needed help with one ending I had to look up and four name tags, three from chapter five and one from chapter four. 
So I, I think I did pretty good. I don't like looking stuff up, but like literally that last name tag I showed, well, the last two, I, there's no way I would have ever found those. There's no way. Maybe the one in the, uh, the blood bucket, I could have swore I checked there, but I must've just missed it. But <laughs> those other two, it's, it's not fair. This game has been very fair up until that point. But uh, anyways, real quick too with the achievements. Um, we got everything except um, view every ending. And then those four I'm missing are the four like extra chapters. Same thing with here. It's just the four endings. So once we get those done, we'll take care of these two. But I don't know what the uh, four hidden achievements are. Um, they might unlock somehow while I'm playing through the extra endings. And if not, I'll definitely show those off too. But again, if you guys, if you're just looking for something in particular, um, any name tags or any endings, and you don't want to watch through all my hours and hours of <laughs> videos, you could just comment and I'll, I'll try to get back to you and let you know how to get it or let you know where the name tag is. Cause I know some of these videos, especially all the videos on chapter five might get really confusing because all the stuff you have to do. And sometimes it's just like, you're trying to find one thing and you don't want to watch like an hour long video looking for one thing. So just leave a comment or check the video description. I, I've been trying to put all the endings and all the name tags, at least the hard ones in the video descriptions. So anyways, that is it for chapter five and the next video, uh, I'll try to get to the uh, extra endings in uh, today or tomorrow, but I'll post those soon. If you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comments below, and thank you for watching.